besides all the elements that the World Conference discusses. excited for today, right? So, the reporting team met for over five hours last night and worked until early this morning, reading through all of the outcomes from yesterday's sessions. First trend was increasing non-formalization of formal education. This will impact our future in a number of ways, including new needs of global world where formal institutions are tapping into experimental learning, among others, to prepare young people for this world. demographics and an aging world population. This will impact us by increasing the gap between generations, opportunities to diversify the models of recruitment of adults and volunteering, the need to redefine what it means to be young and old, and a shift in economic power. Migration, mobility and urbanization is another trend which will impact scouting, by losing talents in the NSOs due to mobility, refugees, or studying abroad, risks of loss of young members, but also opportunities for more diverse membership bases and demand for flexibility and adaptation of the ways we do scouting. Pretty much impressed, especially about the um, 
the uh, UN's uh, uh, Sustainability Development Goals, and then the Scouts are actively trying to uh, work on that particular goals. And uh, I think that it is very important because uh, that probably will be governing the whole world in the coming decade or so. so. here at the second World Scout Education Congress and I've had an opportunity to attend sessions today on youth resilience, uh, communication methods, and uh, essential life skills and professional skills in 2023 as part of WASM's vision uh, for the future. I've had a great time getting to interact and meet folks from all over the world in different uh, National Scout organizations. 